We've all heard the adage, breakfast is the most important meal of the day. But is it really? While the answer isn't a simple yes or no, breakfast does play a significant role in our daily routines and overall well-being. It kickstarts our metabolism, providing energy after hours of fasting during sleep. Think of it like this, you're fueling up your car after a long night in the garage. Breakfast provides the necessary fuel for our bodies and minds to function optimally throughout the day. Without it, we might experience dips in energy, focus, and overall productivity. However, the most important label can be debated. Some individuals thrive on a later first meal, while others find breakfast essential for managing their weight and blood sugar levels. Ultimately, the key is to listen to your body and find an eating pattern that aligns with your individual needs and lifestyle. Skipping breakfast once in a while probably won't have a major impact on your health. However, consistently skipping breakfast can lead to some noticeable short-term effects. Many people experience increased fatigue and reduced concentration throughout the morning when they skip breakfast. This is because your body is running on empty, lacking the necessary fuel from food to power your brain and muscles. You might also notice increased irritability and difficulty managing your mood. Low blood sugar levels, often associated with skipping breakfast, can disrupt hormonal balance, contributing to mood swings. It's important to remember that these short-term effects vary from person to person. Factors like your overall diet, activity level, and individual metabolism play a role in how your body responds to skipping breakfast. A common claim is that skipping breakfast slows down your metabolism, making it harder to lose or maintain weight. While the relationship between breakfast and metabolism is complex, it's not entirely straightforward. Your metabolism, the process of converting food into energy, is influenced by various factors, including your age, body composition, and activity level. While eating breakfast can temporarily increase your metabolic rate due to the energy required to digest and absorb food, the long-term impact on metabolism from skipping breakfast is less clear. Some studies suggest that skipping breakfast might lead to overeating later in the day, potentially contributing to weight gain. However, other research indicates that meal frequency, whether you eat three meals a day or several smaller meals, might be more important for weight management than simply eating or skipping breakfast. Let's take a look at some real-life examples. Imagine Sarah, a busy professional who often skips breakfast due to time constraints. She notices that by mid-morning she feels sluggish, her concentration wavers during important meetings, and she experiences intense cravings for sugary snacks. On the other hand, we have John, a marathon runner who follows a strict training regimen. He finds that eating a balanced breakfast provides him with sustained energy for his morning runs and prevents him from feeling lightheaded during intense workouts. These examples highlight the individual nature of how skipping breakfast affects people differently. While Sarah experiences negative consequences, John thrives on fueling his body before demanding physical activity. It's crucial to pay attention to your body's signals and adjust your eating habits accordingly. If you find that skipping breakfast leaves you feeling drained and unproductive, it might be beneficial to incorporate a nutritious morning meal into your routine. Section 5. Long-Term Implications Can skipping breakfast impact your health in the long run? While the short-term effects of skipping breakfast are generally manageable, the potential long-term implications are worth considering. Some studies suggest a correlation between habitually skipping breakfast and an increased risk of developing certain health conditions. For instance, research indicates that skipping breakfast might be associated with an increased risk of type 2 diabetes, particularly in individuals who are already at risk. This might be linked to the impact of skipping breakfast on blood sugar control and insulin sensitivity. Furthermore, some studies suggest a potential link between regularly skipping breakfast and an increased risk of heart disease. However, more research is needed to establish a definitive causal relationship. It's important to emphasize that these studies often show correlation, not causation. Other lifestyle factors, such as diet, exercise, and genetics, play a significant role in these health conditions. Section 6. Busting Breakfast Myths – Separating Fact from Fiction Numerous myths and misconceptions surround breakfast, often perpetuated by popular culture and marketing campaigns. Let's debunk some of the most common ones. Skipping breakfast will automatically make you lose weight. While skipping breakfast might temporarily reduce your calorie intake, it can lead to overeating later in the day, potentially negating any potential weight loss benefits. You must eat breakfast within a specific time frame after waking up to reap its benefits. There's no magic time window for breakfast. 
Listen to your body's hunger cues and eat when you feel hungry, regardless of the time. Breakfast must consist of traditional breakfast foods. A nutritious breakfast can include a variety of foods, from leftovers to sandwiches to smoothies, as long as it provides a balanced mix of nutrients. Section 7 The Takeaway to Eat or Not to Eat So, what's the final verdict on skipping breakfast? The reality is, there's no one-size-fits-all answer. Whether or not to eat breakfast is a personal decision that depends on individual factors and preferences. If you're aiming to improve your energy levels, focus, and overall well-being, incorporating a healthy breakfast into your routine might be beneficial. On the other hand, if you find that skipping breakfast works well for your body and doesn't negatively impact your health, there's no need to force yourself to eat if you're not hungry. The key is to be mindful of your body's signals, make informed choices about your eating habits, and prioritize a balanced and nutritious diet throughout the day. Section 8. Beyond the Bowl, Resources for Further Exploration If you're interested in delving deeper into the science of breakfast and its impact on your health, numerous resources are available online and in libraries. Reputable sources like the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, the American Heart Association, and the National Institutes of Health provide evidence-based information on nutrition and healthy eating habits. You can also consult with a registered dietitian or a qualified healthcare professional for personalized guidance tailored to your specific needs and health goals. They can help you create a sustainable eating plan that aligns with your lifestyle and optimizes your overall well-being. Section 9. A Call to Action Make Informed Choices for a Healthier You Ultimately, the decision of whether or not to eat breakfast is a personal one. However, by understanding the potential benefits and drawbacks, separating fact from fiction, and listening to your body's needs, you can make informed choices that support your overall health and well-being. Remember, breakfast is just one piece of the puzzle when it comes to a healthy lifestyle. Prioritizing a balanced diet, regular physical activity, adequate sleep, and stress management are equally important for maintaining optimal health in the long run. Start by paying attention to how you feel when you skip breakfast versus when you eat it. Experiment with different breakfast options and meal timings to find what works best for you. And most importantly, don't be afraid to seek guidance from qualified healthcare professionals for personalized advice and support. Your health is a journey, not a destination. By making conscious and informed choices, you can embark on a path towards a healthier, happier you. Please support our channel by subscribing for more informative content.